Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to verify the Green's theorem and from the question, we can take u and v and this is our u, u equal to xy plus y square and v is x square. Let's find dou u by dou y. x is a constant, y differentiation is 1 and y square is 2y and dou v by dou x is 2x and the given boundaries are y is equal to x, y is equal to x square. So let's take a small diagram. We have horizontal and vertical axis that is this is x and y. y equal to x is a line which passes through origin at an angle of 45 degree like this and y equal to x square is a parabola which opened upward symmetrical about y axis like this and this is our region and this point is O which is origin 0 comma 0 and this point is A. To find the meeting point we are going to equate both the curve y value. Equating both the y from this we get x equal to x square taking everything on one side we get x square minus x is equal to 0 taking x common x into x minus 1 is equal to 0 from this we get x as 0 x as 1 and corresponding y value are 0 and 1 by substituting x value in the equation so one meeting point is 0 comma 0 and another one is 1 comma 1 0 comma 0 already we marked here and this point is 1 comma 1 and this is the boundary y is equal to x this is another boundary y is equal to x square. Now coming to the Green's theorem, integral over c u dx plus v dy equal to double integral over the region r dou v by dou y minus dou u by dou x into dx into dy. Let's take the LHS. In LHS, we have integral over C and it is split into two parts that is from 0 that is sorry from O to A is one boundary then from A to O is another boundary. So it is taken as integral OA plus integral AO. First part integral OA is nothing but the value of the boundary y is equal to x square. So we take y equal to x square and its differentiation dy equal to 2x dx. So here wherever y is there we have to substitute the x square. So from the question it is xy plus y square. So integral xy plus xy plus y square but y square is x square whole square so that becomes x power 4 into dx and plus we have another term x square dy so we take this as x square but dy is 2x dx and the limit for this boundary it starts from 0 and the boundary till here we have it is end at 1 so the limit is from 0 to 1 this is x cube so integral 0 to 1 x cube plus x power 4 and this is 2x cube dx combining this 3x cube plus x power 4 integral 0 to 1 dx on integration it is 3 x power 4 by 4 plus x power 5 by 5 and limit is 0 to 1 by substituting the upper limit we get 3 by 4 plus 1 by 5 and lower limit is 0 now the LCM is 20 so 15 plus 4 totally it is 19 by 20 
coming to the another part it is from a o that is a to o and this limit from a to o the curve is y is equal to x and the limit is again 1 to 0 because it is decreasing so from a till o so from a to o it is again 1 to 0 the curve is y is equal to x so let's write y equal to x dy equal to dx it is 1 to 0 wherever y is there we have to substitute x so it is xy plus y square so x y plus y square is x square dx plus and the second part is x square into dy so x square and dy is dx now this is x square and this is x square so 2x square plus x square and limit is from 1 to 0 dx so it is totally x cube sorry 3x square on integration it is 3x cube by 3 after cancelling this we left with x cube limit is from 1 to 0 now substituting the limit we get upper limit minus lower limit which is minus 1 so totally integral over c is made up of integral a o plus integral sorry first is o a then integral a o so first is o a plus integral a o and the first part is 19 by 20 minus 1 by taking lcm we get 19 minus 20 which is minus 1 by 20 next part we have to write the right hand side of the Green's theorem which is here we shall write it again that is double integral over the region r dou v by dou x minus dou u by dou y into dx into dy now we have to take dou v by dou x and dou u by dou x from this so double integral this is 2x minus x minus 2y into dx dy and now the limit first we have to consider the horizontal strip it starts from here and end here the value of x from this is x is equal to y because we already have y is equal to x so x is y and from this x is root y so y to root y it starts from y end with root y because first is we are going to do integration with respect to x then coming to the y we have to take a vertical strip and this extends the bottommost value is 0 and topmost value is 1 so this from 0 to 1 now let's rewrite this once again integral 0 to 1 integral y to root y x minus 2y into dx dy and this part we are going to evaluate first with respect to x so it means its integration is x square by 2 2 is a constant so constant into x and we have to put the limit which is y to root y integral 0 to 1 into dy now in place of x we have to put the upper limit so when i put root y here it will become y by 2 minus when i put root y here so 2y into root y then when I put lower limit y square by 2 minus 2y square and the entire thing is inside the integral limit from 0 to 1 and integration with respect to y. We are going to simplify this. This is 
y by 2 minus 2 y power 3 by 2 combining the powers and this will become after simplification 1 minus 4 is minus 3 so minus 3 y square by 4 already there is a minus so make it as plus 3 y square by 2 now we have to integrate this part with respect to y so this will be y square by 2 already there is a 2 so it is 4 then this will become minus 2 into y power 3 by 2 is y power 5 by 2 by 5 by 2 that can be written as into 2 by 5 here then plus 3 y cube by 3 already there is a 2 so it becomes 6 and we have to substitute the limit 0 to 1 when I put 1 it is 1 by 4 minus 4 by 5 plus this is 1 by 2 lower limit everything is 0 the LCM is 20 so 5 minus 16 plus 10 and totally 5 plus 10 is 15 15 minus 16 is minus 1 so minus 1 by 20 so even in LHS we got the same so we can say LHS equal to RHS hence Green's theorem is verified.